and my children are in the next room paying rather more attention than is usual to the House's proceedings this afternoon. But what steps is my right and friend taking to help schools and colleges to take up the offer that the government has made to provide rapid testing, which will be so vital in helping to keep children, teachers and indeed parents safe? Secretary of State. Well, I think my uh, honourable friend makes an important point. This isn't just about helping schools. It's not just about helping pupils and that workforce within the schools, but it's helping the families with school-aged children. It's helping the whole community push back the tide of this virus because we'll be testing more people as a result of this than ever before, literally testing millions of children every single week. And yes, we recognise that schools need that extra support. That's why that we created the fund of £78 million in order to be able to support them. And we've shared that information with schools uh, the other week as to how much money that they'll be eligible to get. But we do understand that there'll be some schools that have a unique problems or challenges in rolling out this mass testing and that's why I'm incredibly grateful to Her Majesty's Armed Forces uh, for making themselves available as well as Ofsted in supporting schools who are having challenges in rolling out the mass testing programme to ensure that it is implemented in all secondary schools and all colleges because this will benefit everyone within school, everyone in college and everyone within the community.